guys welcome back to my channel for another video if you're new here welcome if you're a returning subscriber welcome back goody so guys in today's video i'm going to show you guys how to make this exfoliating scalp scrub and this scalp scrub is to basically clean all your scalp from all those chemical product buildup and all of that for hair growth so guys this is very easy to make you're going to need about four ingredients okay so some beeswax some garlic sugar coconut oil and yeah that's about it so guys i am going to add about a quarter cup of my beeswax i added one cup of sugar and this is based on your household guys if you're making it for yourself you don't have to make a, you don't have to use a cup of sugar just make enough for yourself i'm using about a quarter cup of coconut oil and the next ingredient is garlic and garlic is just amazing for your scalp garlic has antimicrobial properties that help to kill germs and bacteria on the scalp and these bacteria are responsible to ca of causing damage to the scalp that will inhibit hair growth on your scalp so the raw garlic as you can see there guys i added the raw garlic i did not blend it because if you add water to this it's going to melt right don't worry about pieces left in your hair when you wash it it's going to come out because there's nothing there's no pieces in my hair presently the raw garlic is known to be rich in vitamin c and that will help to promote healthy hair growth it also contains um collagen and collagen what collagen does guys collagen it helps to stimulate hair growth it is very good to add to your hair growth regimen is garlic as you can see i showed you guys um how grainy the sugar was on my hand and you can add some essential oil to this if you would like that and i'm adding my beeswax this is optional you don't have to add the beeswax i just add the beeswax for um thickness to like for the product for consistency to make it be thicker but it's it's not necessary to add beeswax guys and i added some color because you know i don't like plain stuff i like it to look fun right because doing diy should be fun so i like to enjoy myself and use colors this is not necessary and it's not going to do any damage to your scalp as well because these powders are naturally derived okay so garlic also helps to boost blood circulation on the scalp so guys the presence of selenium content that is in garlic it helps to boost blood circulation for maximum nourishment garlic also helps to cleanse hair follicles and it also helps to strengthen and prevent clogging on your scalp and you know what those clogging will cause it will cause hair loss and your hair will not look as best as it should because it's all the scalp is clogged that mean the hair is not getting the nutrients so your hair is going to look brittle and dry and it's just not going to look lively It also helps to treat dangers as well guys as I mentioned before that it cleans the scalp from all the bacteria and all the germs so it helps to prevent dangers and I'm going to show you guys how I apply this to my hair so guys when applying this to your hair just to, a disclaimer guys please if you have eczema if you have acne and like paresis don't any type of scalp condition don't use this on your scalp you should not use any type of scrubs on your scalp because that can cause further um, irritation on your scalp and it is sometimes it will make your scalp even bleed because you're irritating too much but if you know that you don't have any type of scalp condition then you can go ahead 
and do a scalp scrub when applying this to your scalp though make sure that you're not like being too aggressive on it even the reason why i chose to use sugar is because sugar is softer so it will give your scalp a gently gentle scrub so you don't have to worry about it irritating you too much even though you don't have scalp um problems you don't have to worry about it irritating it too much you won't have any burning on your scalp after you wash it out and sugar will dissolve while you're scrubbing it and it also will dissolve when you're rinsing it out so guys not only did this help my scalp but it also had my hair feeling super super soft so just remember guys if you're going to use this please make sure that you don't have any type of scalp condition where you're going to use it and you're going to irritate your scalp more and also this is very this is a messy this is a messy treatment so you're gonna have sugar grains all over flying everywhere so if you want to do it in the bathroom you can do it but i had to do it in front of the camera for you guys to see how i apply it to my scalp so yeah let's get into some of the benefits of you doing like scrubbing your scalp and as far exfoliating your scalp if i should say let's get into some of the benefit so if you if you know that you have like dandruff on your scalp and you're somebody who uses a lot of product like you're a product junkie and you do that a dry shampoo you're definitely going to need a scalp scrub if you have fine hair then you definitely might need a, a scalp scrub as well and i'm showing you guys what it mean by product build up on your scalp as you can see on my scalp there very white that is all product build up so you, some shampoos might get it off but it will not give it the deep clean and the deep clean is coming from scrubbing the hair when you scrub the scalp um gently you exfoliate it i don't i think like i'm using scrub it's so like i'm being aggressive on it but i really wasn't being aggressive when you're exfoliating your your scalp it also helps to let product seep into like it give the product a better avenue to sweep, seep into your scalp so guys scalp scrubs work wonders for your hair just as how you would use a body exfoliator or you will exfoli exfoliate your face to get rid of the dead skin cells and it's the same thing you're getting rid of dead skin cells on your scalp and guys you can see how my hair look very soft and shiny and that is one of the reason why i use coconut oil coconut oil sometimes it can be drying on your hair but coconut oil is one of those oils that will pass like will penetrate your hair it will go through your cuticle and penetrate inside of your hair so you can see that there wasn't any oil sitting on top of my hair even though i'm 4c because coconut oil have the tendency of doing that so guys after rinsing everything out and i use a shampoo because and a sulfage free shampoo of course and because of the garlic scent <laughs> i didn't want to um my hair to smell like garlic and you can see how my scalp is looking okay so we're going to talk a little bit about this picture you can see how the picture before it looks very white and the picture after you can see how clean my scalp look some shampoo can do this but sometimes it don't get everything out using a scalp scrub will get all that product build up off your scalp so scalp scrubs are very important you don't have to do scalp scrub every wash day you can do it like twice a month or once a month you don't have to let go all in and do it every wash day so guys i would like to hear from you down below in the comment section let's go talk down below what do you guys think do you guys think that scalp scrub is important from the information that was given in this video and yeah let me know if you're ever going to try this recipe and i will see you guys in my next one